guys. Welcome back to Cards TV. This is Mary, and it's time for another Paper Playtime Challenge. And this time, Janice has challenged us to make something and use a bee. A really fun challenge. So I'm going to give you a link so you can come over and check out what my design team sisters have done with bees. And you can also check out the prize. Our sponsor this time is Teresa the Scrapbooking Queen. And she's going to give the winner a set of her stamps called Royal Pain. And they're really cute, guys. So just use the link to go on over and check everything out and join us in this challenge. Now for my B card, I've used Kate's ABCs and Create a Critter, two really cute cartridges, and I've already got my card put together, and I did something a little different this time. I used a four and a quarter by five and a half inch white card base, and I cut my designer paper, this little uh, white and marigold polka dot paper, to fit it exactly, so it was cut at four and a quarter by five and a half. This marigold paper was cut at four by five and a quarter and I used my Cuddlebug honeycomb embossing folder to make it look just like a honeycomb. I think that's really cute. Now I took an EK Success punch for my sentiment and it's got bees in your bonnet <laughs> and that sentiment came from one of my stamp sets. This one's called Going Buggy. Here it is right here. And you can see this is all out in one line, but I've got it on two lines on my uh, little sentiment mat. I just took some scissors and carefully snipped that. And that makes your stamps a lot more versatile and it doesn't hurt the stamps at all. So you can go ahead and do that and when I want to use it out in a line again, I'll just line it up on my stamp block and it works perfectly. I added two little rhinestones that my sweet friend Denitra had sent me. Love those. They're so pretty. Now my little bee came from Create a Critter and you'll find him on page 68. Here he is right here and he's got just a few layers and he's on an action wobble because he's buzzing around this bonnet. Now the little bonnet came from Kate's ABCs. That's page 28. And it's got, let's see, one, two, three, four, six layers. But it was really easy and fun to put together. And I think it turned out really cute. The bonnet and the bee were both cut at two inches. And the bonnet is on two thicknesses of foam tape. Now I kept the inside really simple. I have a background mat, which is the same color as the bonnet. And this was cut at two and a half by four and a quarter. My marigold mat, where I stamped my sentiment, was cut at two and a quarter by four. And this little polka dot strip right here is three quarters of an inch by three and a quarter. And I used the same color red to punch out a little heart using this Studio G heart punch. And this sentiment right here also came from Going Buggy. There it is right there, Be Happy. So there you have it. That's my B card. It's just a cute little friendship card or thinking of you card. So guys, make sure you use the link now and come on over and take this challenge with us. It's a really fun one. Thank you so much for stopping by today. I'll see you again soon. Bye now.